I need you to, I need you to get a set of weights that you can do bicep curls with. And here's what I recommend. Go to Target or Walmart and find two weights. So my preferred is 10 pounds. And I need you to, in that aisle of the store, I to do a bicep curl. Does it feel difficult? So try it. Yeah. So I'm using 10. Some of my patients use 5, 8, 12, no more than 15. So step one, I need some heavy weights for your arms. Number two, I am recommending this weighted bar so that you can do some heavier deadlift and squats and begin to learn how to lift heavy, but safely in your home. Okay, so this one's 30 pounds. And Romanian deadlift is my favorite one where you are sliding the bar down your thighs. I think it's quite lovely. I'm engaging my abs. So I'm talking things like this. You can do overhead stuff, but I need you to try to be stronger. And this bar is a really good way. You can also do a bend of a row. Now listen, you can do rows with other things, but I think I like how this feels and the heaviness. Okay, so these are two things. Let me show you another thing. And I honestly think kettlebells are a great workout. Now, this is a five pound kettlebell. I also have 10 and I also have 15. I think kettlebells are really helpful for a lot of movements. And so finding an affordable kettlebell would be great. I bought these from TikTok shop and they are the, my most favorite ones I've owned. I've owned several types, but things like the Turkish get up. You could do kettlebell swings. There are lots of things that you can do. This is personally my beginner favorite starting weightlifting routine. So with this one, I will show like a basic kettlebell swing. Now I like to have the kettlebell versus a weight because if I can do this, I feel like it's easier for me. And here's the thing, buy what you can afford but this is my bias as a physical therapist that takes care of women and tries to help women have muscle bulk. Kettlebells, some weights, and a weighted bar. That's my beginning gym.